they like <laughs> they like have poop come out which is gross but it's kind of cute because they're sloths Hello everybody and welcome once again back to another video on my channel. Now hopefully the setup looks a bit better this week. I figured out how to work the light on my camera so hopefully it looks a bit more professional. Um, it's only the second time I've filmed on this camera so hopefully it looks better. So on the video and as you can tell from the title today we're going to be doing like a sloth haul of things that I've been given, things that I've brought over the last few years and it is quite a lot. We have a lot to get through so let's get into it. So the first thing, I think you've seen this in a wish haul video but it is a sloth necklace and it's just like a nice little simple chain um, I don't really wear it out but it's just cute and it's cute just to hang around and everything because it's just cute because it's a sloth so. Um, so, oh. and so the next thing we have um, is something I got off my boyfriend and it comes in a little box like this which kind of sexist but you know um, and inside is these little sloth earrings and they are so cute aren't they and um, so I've got two I mean I've only got one ear pierced but I can always just wear one and have a spare so they're cute as well so thanks Andrew okay speaking of Andrew um, one of the things he got me for Christmas this year is a make your own sloth kit which I haven't yet to do because I wanted to show it in this video before we did it so maybe I'll do a video of me making it or something but it's just like I think it's I don't know if it's play or clay or something but it's really cute and I'm definitely gonna have so much fun doing that okay and you've seen these next items in a wish haul before but whilst we're on the matter is my little sloth photo frames uh, where am I showing you? there we go um, so I've just brought these off wish and I've framed them myself because they're cute. I just hang them up in my bedroom because they are really adorable. Okay, something I got off my mum for Christmas is a little, uh, one of them little thing, solar panel moving sloths and, and he just moves about. So I love that. I don't have a car but it just sits up in my, in my room for now until I get a car and then he'll be first place in there. Another thing off my mum is this cute little light. It lights up, if you can see it. There we go. Uh, and it's what did it actually say on it? Relax and take it slow. And this glass bottle, and it's actually like really pretty. It's just one of the things nice to display in a bedroom. So I love that. Literally, everyone knows me so well. Okay, and stationery of Andrew is my is a sloth pen. Um, I brought this this pen I brought from Primark. Another little sloth one. How do you do it? I'm not a guru or nothing. Anyway. By the way, I'm trying to look from there and there. I'm still getting used to this, so if it's half screen, I apologise. And a pencil, which has got a little sloth uh, snoring on it, so that's also adorable. Uh, some little key rings um, from my mum for Christmas, like a little packet. Um, and we've got like little bronzy different colours in, so I need to put them on my keys. Uh, oh. I think my mum for Christmas once again is um, it's a grow your own sloth so you put this thing in water and then a sloth comes out eventually so that needs to be fixed done and another one off my nan another grow your own sloth so this one is just like a one you put in water as well and it gets bigger I guess after like three days so that'll be exciting to watch that happen I've also off my mother got a watch I mean I'm, I don't really wear watches very often but this is actually quite cute. So if I need a watch, then I've got one. If not, it just looks cute hanging up anyway, so it doesn't actually matter too much. Um, my mum, again, my mum got me so much lost off for Christmas, it's sure something real. Um, it's this little squidgy thing. It comes with these two little squidgy sloths inside of it. You can poke them and prod them and do all the things. And they're just so cute and squidgy and fun to play with. Once again, off my mum for Christmas, is I've got these two little squidgy key rings. And basically, if you squidge them, they like, <laughs> they like have poop come out, which is gross, but it's kind of cute because they're sloths. So they are very adorable as well. And then I've treated myself to this one because out of all these little sloth items, this is one of the things I don't have. Um, and it's like, you can just like mold it into place. I think that's literally all it does. It's like some kind of rubbery thing, but that's fun because it's moldable. Uh, off for Christmas I also got off somebody a sloth's guide to taking it easy book so I don't actually know what side I haven't a chance to read it yet but it's just like a fun little book with cartoons and stuff inside of it so that's quite cute and fun um, I've still got a calendar 
as well because I've never had a sloth calendar before and that was cute. I mean, I was choi torn for choice between sloths or sloths doing yoga, but then like I saw this one, I was like, but I just want the classic because I can't mess with the classic. And then also, what I got this is actually kind of a bit of a review for slash present, but basically, if I can do it right, it's a little sloth on a tree. If you can see that, and he lights up like that and colour changes and he sits on this thing like that and that is very cute now the reason why it's forward slash a review because I picked this out I wanted it and my mum got it for me for Christmas so I knew what I was getting um, and it basically on the box it was a picture of a sloth hanging from a tree like this um, but it turns out the tree you had to make yourself and it's literally just cardboard so I was thinking you'd get, like, you'd get like a proper plastic little stump or something but you have to actually assemble the tree and that's okay and everything but it's cardboard and that's heavy plastic so it does just about stand but I don't know how long necessarily this will last compared to that and also at the bottom you have to put these slits in right and they you know you get a slit in but they're in there but this one did not fit so I had to like make use use some scissors and carve it luckily I managed to do it carefully enough but if I wasn't smart enough to do it or something, then no one would have even fit it together and that would have failed. So, But apart from that, it's a light, amazing, I love it. And the last section is the cuddly things. We're nearly done, I promise. So first of all, I brought this little guy. It's a TY and his name is Dangler and he was so cute. I saw him and had to get him. Next one, Primark were quite good with their sloth stuff this year. So I've got this one, which basically has a little bean bag inside it's one of the things you can put in the microwave and then snuggle up to it and it's so soft it is literally the softest thing ever and then from Primark as well hot water bottle you've probably seen these if you've been there recently um so it's just has a hot water inside and it's the soft it's like the same softness as that it's amazing um my sister pretty much was the first person to buy me anything sloth related and she brought me a bunch of these little guys i've got quite a few of them um in different colours. I've got like two or three, three or four of them I think and there's a couple more I need to collect and he's so cute and everything. Uh, also for my sister for a birthday present one time she got me this little guy and um, he is like so he's just like a long fun cuddly sloth and he's so cute. <laughs> Last item on the list I believe <laughs> is this really amazing sloth pillow which I needed in my life. It's one of the mermaid ones so you can do this and it's like a shiny pillow or do that and it's a sloth appears out of nowhere. So I saw that one I did. Now I do, one of the things I do need which I don't have yet as well is the Zootopia Flash sloth from that because I, I need him I don't have him yet so he's one of the things on my list to get as well as a bunch more sloth things that I see throughout so it's not the end of the collection oh I've forgotten one thing actually but I nearly forgot as well I've got a little sloth covered notebook and I write down stuff in there like me and Megan have started to write down some YouTube videos in it and things like that so that's always very handy so yeah I believe that's it now um I'm sure I'll do a part two in a year or so, or even sooner than that, because it's not going to be the last bit. But, you know, if you love sloths, give this video a big like. Tell me what your favourite thing was below. And if you want to know where it's from, I could probably, like, tell you in the comments, because I could find out where I know where most of it's all from anyway. So, it's all quite local, like, general shops and that anyway. So, oh. And I did forget as well, my phone case. I've got a sloth pop socket and my phone case is kind of tearing apart now. But that was a sloth as well. So before I forget anything else to add to the list, <laughs> that will be the end of the video. Um, if you did like this video, please feel free to give it a like, share with friends, subscribe, and I'll see you very soon with another video.